I've had COVID and I have recovered. Is COVID potentially dangerous to men on testosterone or using anabolic steroids? The data is controversial showing men with low testosterone are at risk. It does appear that men and older men are at higher risk for complications from COVID. I can tell you that I'm on testosterone and my testosterone levels are perfect. So it did not provide protection for me from getting sick. But I'm here today and I'm feeling great. I've been back on the bench and getting stronger. In addition, I'm back on the bike with the poodle. Thank God I'm okay. My thoughts about COVID and testosterone and steroids. Okay. COVID can lead to a viral-induced cardiomyopathy, a form of heart failure where your heart is diseased and can't adequately pump. You feel tired, weakened, and it can be limited or it can be permanent. We have no data, but it will come. My assumption is that men with underlying heart disease, coronary artery disease, hypertension, lipids, and diabetes, obstructive sleep apnea, are definitely at greatest risk. There is also controversy over a class of medications called ACE inhibitors, which I was on, that increases the risks for becoming infected with COVID. Additionally, it appears that COVID can increase a person's susceptibility to blood clots. The mechanism of action is unclear, but platelet counts have been seen to decrease in many people infected with COVID. There may be other factors that increase one's hypercoagulability state. This can lead to strokes, DVTs, and pulmonary embolism. I experienced my right eye droop very soon after I developed symptoms from COVID. Fortunately, I did not experience any stroke symptoms and this thing resolved about two weeks after I was recovered. This was very scary to me. I've done consultations with over 100 men who have had COVID and were on testosterone and steroids. There appears to be no association for increased disease of any sort after recovery. As all the men I've talked to have recovered and are doing well and have no limitations in exercise or any medical conditions. However, I am going to ask you to keep your guard up and to limit the use of high dose and toxic compounds such as TREN and oral regimens with too much testosterone. I think this could weaken your heart and that may make you susceptible to permanent disease from COVID. Be vigilant on your vital signs blood pressure, and heart rate. Check your labs with a CBC. Pay attention to elevated red blood cells and decreased platelets, as this may increase your risk for hypercoagulable disease, such as stroke, DVT, and pulmonary embolism. Check a comprehensive metabolic for kidney and liver function. Manage blood pressure very closely. We do not have enough data to say that you should discontinue any ACE inhibitors or ARBs at this time, but you may want to discuss this with your healthcare provider. Holding during COVID and switch to another class of medicines such as cardioselective beta blocker, thiazide diuretics, or calcium channel blockers. Ask if taking 325 milligrams of aspirin is an option for you, and most importantly, stay in close contact with your health care provider. My app will be a very important diagnostic and management tool for men looking to get answers to questions like this and in more detail, not to mention other important medical questions related to common men's health issues. Thank you so much for trusting me.